the story problem might just say subtract. There would be no worries. The answer to a subtraction problem is called the difference. If you decrease, you would take away or subtract. Fewer than. I've left three little dots here to say that the verbiage of the story problem does use the words fewer, and later on in the problem it says than. Other words are put in between. So you might have an example like, uh, let, let's use my mouse. Um, a mouse has four legs, a spider has eight. How many fewer legs does the mouse have than the spider? You see how those words were in here where the, the fewer and the than were broken apart by other vocabulary. <clears throat> Similarly, more than. I could change that out. <clears throat> um, how many more legs does the spider have than the mouse? Take away is a subtraction idea left. If you went into the store with a $20 bill and made a purchase that was uh, $14, you would get some change and you would have money left. Similarly, change in a, in a uh, money problem would suggest operation if you had change. Minus. If you lose something, it's taken away. Opposites are an interesting one. The problem is not going to say opposite. It's, it's probably show opposites. For example, if you have um, maybe young and old, um, boy and girl. For example, if you had, if, the, if your school had 100, 100 children in it, um, 55 of them were boys, how many would be girls? Opposites. When, when the situation is set up with an opposite idea. Um, there were eight plates. Two were dirty. How many were clean? Clean and dirty. So your opposites are um, a giveaway for a subtraction function. We've talked about opposites. If we talk about comparisons, you might have words that have an ER or an EST ending on them. Comparing, there, were, there was a, um, a girl that was three feet tall and one five feet tall. How much taller was the second girl from the first? Uh, if you're comparing three, three pieces of information, you might have uh, the, the children being three feet, six, five feet, and um, seven feet tall. Who was the tallest if we're, if we're making a comparison among three? So comparisons and opposites scream subtraction. <clears throat>